Studying astrology killed the wonder of the stars. Over a summer of endless inferno. Concussion by Caucasian. Eyes and iPhones clenched at the sight. The way I scan any man who walks through the door. My mother and I perched on the dead wood and the wood still growing. The crow lives in their Sunday's feathers. Funeral black in all their dwelling. Stiff as the white of my knuckles from the room next to my mother's as she cries and calls. My eyes are not so good as they have been, as I can't tell if this is a crow or a raven. And I don't know what it's saying to its family as it scans me for safety. The way I scan any man who walks through the door or speaks, the crow can hold a grudge and tell others of your birthmarks your round face. A raven can mourn a death, then comfort their grieving. It's the difference between a murder and an unkindness, really. I kept all the scans and cast irons ready. A man's skull can be made soft, no matter how large he is, and crows have regional dialects they can shift between, and my mother's words come slower now that she is bruised in the land of the undead. A group of ravens are called a conspiracy when not called an unkindness, but are they either? Does it matter that my mother is divorced instead of widowed? And I, not yet an assassin. Viral, one, shook. Cop grip on boy neck. Cop stash of new chests. Cop pop of blue Roxies. Cop claim on nightstand. Cop stain on sheets white. Cop snarl for ice water. I can do that. I can bend forward trip the line of my knees back. I can do that, brace the buds of my tongue back. Life so tasteless, pig shit as macaroon, tasteless in my mouth. I'll wash it down, blood in my snapback. Concussion by Caucasian. I can do that, do my lone self, do me, my me alone. Do that, my standstill, do that, my breath in, do that, my breath out. I can do that. Do that, my foot stepped. Do that, my foot backed. Do that, my back down. I can do that, my lone self. No help needed, no bad needed. I can do the dialogue. No brass needed, no red tape, no headline, no protest. Precedent already set. Square hole with a square peg. Square hole with a round peg if you push hard. Square hole with a man peg if you blast hard. One shot to my black corner. One shot to my black corners. One shot to my pink leftovers if it bleeds wrong in case it gets rowdy. Talks of healing back, of walking back to pick up its head and walk some more. Like in the good book, like in the podcast, like in the newscast, like in the cartoon, like in the rom-com, like in the timeline. Two shots in the new gif, two shots in the dance challenge. When my body dancing picks up its head and moon walks back to the live stream, to the one channel, to the one body, I'll be on both sides of the screen, surprised to share his name, my stunt double, always in drag. Two, jive. We're not killing niggers, just showing we can. Give us two shots and a geo filter. Two shots for the thirst trap. FaceTime with the body. See it laugh back. Dap you up if you bout it. Duck lips like it's 2013. Ass out like it's 16 year old and dead. 15 years old and dead. 20 years old and dead. Can't no one do it better. Die like this and this and this and die another time. This be the standing ovation. This be the final call. 10 years and running, 30 years and running, 100 years and running. Niggers, we've lost count. Niggers still counting, but niggers lost count. And look, you done fucked it up. Asked us who the stunt double is, dumb nigger, it's you. Abyss, 
for Jordan Neely, 1993 to 2023. I have not been able to touch the destruction within me. Audrey Lord, power. Hell rose hot and hungry as a white chokehold around another black neck. Nostrils lit, eyes and iPhones clenched at the sight, the sheer lack of air, the smell of his last breath, got Iblis on brick, thick, it spit like lava, by the time the F train conductor snatched the lever, turned Grim Reaper said, you're gonna kill him. The three vigilantes had already gone viral, orgying over the 30 year old's frame, a fatal attraction. No grammar for the collision, for the sirens screaming, his body's abyss at a frequency lower than death. Meditation on the nature of vastness and its limits. More and more lately, I find summer thunder has become too sporadic a lullaby. Even the stars don't twinkle so much as hesitate to glow, like bulbs just before their filaments expire and burst. I wonder if the sky has finally given up on us. In the desert, Nature organizes itself into patterns, clustered tessellations with occasional breaks in form that our brains recognize as beauty. Even the land seems to believe that's enough to make a waterless life worth struggling through. Studying astrology killed the wonder of the stars is the gist of a woman's lament I overhear on the bus. There is nothing special at all about our galaxy, read the first line of her textbook. I discover a new fear, not of the notion itself, but the comfort I take in accepting it as truth. When I am making love, I don't count the space of the room in square feet. When I am making a thing I love, I don't count my life in time. I've lived now just long enough to understand that some years pass like minutes, others decades. I'm saying hell can have me only when it earns me. I awaken from the nightmare. The hounds have been called back to their cages. Vinegar bitters the roof of my mouth, all that cosmic matter burned to black, then light. What haunts me is not mine, in the sense that I am not mine, and so neither is anything else. Untitled Yellow Page, number one. Style quick checks over clip staple coal, over chopperless blue skies, over a summer of endless inferno, rockets and artillery. Aghast with sycophantic notions, Black iliads pour from activized, catalyzed sensation. And the ghost rivers of Harlem play light patches in your good ear. Sitting sideways in gold rush, downloading mental schematics for what once was natural. Didn't get to see Blue Jezebel as she flew by again. Raven, call him Sunset to cause five times in solidarity for the homies. Call it eco-negro. Still, no blacks in the Yuba, only nude lily whites and eight ball peacocks. Still, there's a hope in the wind that slants pessimism.